All right, I'm Mark Curley. I'm back uh, with another uh, video here. This is not really a how to draw video. It's not even a how to do computer toning video. It's more just kind of a, a cool little technique that I've uh, been using. Uh, I'm sure I'm not the first person to do this. Um, to save myself a little bit of time uh, as I work on these pages here for winter. Uh, as you can see, we have uh, three uh, different panels here. Uh, and uh, Hiro, uh, the main character, the boy, is uh, slowly turning his head up uh, to, to look at something. I won't tell you, I don't want to spoil what it is. But I knew that Miki would essentially be looking exactly the same uh, in all um, three of these panels. So I, th I tried to do this in such a way that I would be able to um, cut and paste, um, just sort of using uh, the power of the computer, uh, copy uh, the Miki part of the illustration and uh, reuse it <laughs> essentially and uh, so what I'm doing right now is uh, is using the mouse to sort of select this area um, and uh, once I get it selected it should be as simple as just doing a, a copy and then moving it over now a lot of times it doesn't um, fill the space exactly the way I hoped it would and then you have to sort of tweak things around but uh, let's see if this works uh, hopefully you'll get a kick out of seeing this so I uh, do I've selected it all now and here's one of the things that I've just started doing on this project I'm so glad that they've made Photoshop uh, able to do this um, this is all saved in layers. You know, I've got all these different layers. Uh, some for the 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 hair. That's a thirty percent gray. This coat is like a fifteen percent gray. Everything's sort of separated out into the different things. The whites uh, here of the coat, even the whites of the eyes. Um, what you can do is collapse all of the layers together. That's what I'm going to do right now. It doesn't show up on the video screen really, uh, but right now, having clicked these buttons, everything is collapsed. Then I copy it and then I do a undo so that I, it's not collapsed anymore but it does allow me to keep that collapsed version of all those layers saved uh, on the uh, in the computer so that I should be able to drop in uh, the new version of uh, Miki into this second panel let's see if it works alright well there she goes uh, now I'm going to sort of maneuver things around here a little bit to see if uh, we can get it. Looks like it, it looks like it's going to uh, overlap things pretty nicely. Um, so I don't know how, if you can see, but in this area right here, she's actually like coming in front of uh, Hiro. It looks very strange. So I am going to momentarily hide that layer so that I can't see it. I'm using my magic wand tool here. I'm trying very hard to select all of this white blank space here. And this is something I've been doing for a very long time with Photoshop. I'm sure a lot of people do this as well. Um, what you do is you inverse. You select this area. Then you do the inverse of that area. Uh, and then you uh, come back and get that layer so it's visible again. And then it's as simple as hitting the delete button. Um, all of that extra stuff gets trimmed away, and uh, it's looking pretty good now. You know, I'm uh, I'm gonna probably tweak things a little bit, but let's see if we can go ahead and do the do the third panel. Um, and this time, I won't be sort of explaining everything so much. I should be able to do it things a little more quickly and give you an idea of how fast this stuff goes uh, once you get used to it. Um, I may be sort of cheating things a little and moving Miki down uh, just to cover up space, but uh, I don't think I want to do that. That might show up too. So, so I can see here that this did not overlap as much as I wanted it to. Kind of a shame, but there are ways of dealing with that. Anyway, I'm hiding it. I'm selecting it. Um, I think we've got a pretty good select there. I mean, I've uh, filled up all that space. Inverse, and then show delete and there she pops right back behind him um, and then maybe I can try to show you what what has to be done down here I don't know how much this will show up but uh, a lot of times what you can do is uh, uh, take a certain area like this I'm selecting an area at the bottom of the coat uh, copying it and doing a sort of a patch 
um, which uh, I'm going to pull down here like this. Uh, and you can kind of play around with it and stretch it until it it will fill in that extra leftover space. I don't know how much this is going <laughs> to show up on YouTube. If it doesn't, my apologies. And you're like looking at this saying, what is he doing? This is, <laughs> this is so boring. Um, but anyway, let me collapse these, these, these two layers together um, after sort of cleaning up this patch thing just a little bit. Uh, collapse these two together. Um, hide it. Select this area again. Inverse. Show and then delete. And uh, there we've got it. Pretty nicely done. There's still a little bit there that may need to be cleaned up. But it gives you an idea of, uh, of how, you know, you can imagine if I had drawn that uh, uh, three different times and uh, gone and uh, toned it in and three different times that that would, uh, you know, it's very time consuming and thank goodness for computers <laughs> that allow, especially I'm really under the gun right now, I'm down to the last uh, pages of this thing and it all has to be done by the end of September. Um, but uh, rather than bore you by just having you stare at the same thing over and over again, I think I'll just sort of wrap things up. Um, just uh, for anyone who doesn't know yet, uh, this is my book here, Miki Falls. Uh, it's a manga. Uh, it's in the stores now. This one, spring and uh, summer, also is in the stores. And the newest one uh, that will be out very soon indeed is called Autumn. And uh, this is going to be out next week, Tuesday. Uh, of course, by the time a lot of you see this video, it's no longer <laughs> next week. But uh, uh, for those of you who are seeing it right away, I hope you will head out there next week, Tuesday, September 25th, uh, to grab a copy of Autumn. Um, and uh, thanks a bunch for watching the vids. Uh, sorry that this is not another How to Draw vid. Uh, it was mainly just because I'm so pressed with the deadlines. But I will be back with uh, a real honest-to-goodness uh, video. I am planning to do a um, video on hands. I've had a lot of requests from people uh, asking me to, to give them some tips on drawing hands. I'm definitely going to be doing a video like that, probably a series of them. And uh, look for, you know, in early October, I'm really going to blast back into YouTube and uh, do a lot more videos than I have been doing lately. It's really just the deadlines that are, are, are stopping me from uh, getting as much uh, video videoing <laughs> done as I would like to. Uh, thanks so much, everyone, for subscribing. 900 subscribers, I can't even believe it. Um, and uh, for the comments and the messages uh, and for you know visiting my website, joining the forum, all the different stuff like that. I really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, you can expect uh, lots of videos for me um, in October and uh, from there on out. Thanks a bunch uh, for watching, folks, and we'll be back again with another video real soon.